Howdy folks, it's me, Mackenzie. <laughs> I'm back to train the divas. Sorry we're getting just a tiny late start here. I ran into some traffic on the way out. Uh, rush hour only goes one way in Missoula and it's this way, unfortunately. Somebody caught sight of me and is ready for their training session. I got a little bit of um, just quick stuff to do. I wanna see if I can grab my can. Pretty sure I left it in here. And then we'll get to some diva training. Um, if you're a new viewer, just to let you know, I'm Mackenzie. I've been coming out to the ranch for some time now. And, oh, hello. Did you want to come do training too? Did you want to come do training too? <laughs> um, worked with the divas for a long time, um, about a year or so. And we did all sorts of different things. We did dress up, we did trips, we had a lot of fun. And now I'm gonna do a little bit more work with them and start getting ready for some more adventures. Um, they really, really, really like training. I don't know if you can tell, but they're pretty excited over there. Which is good and handy. Um, but they also, a little bit shy of surface changes. We worked on that a bunch. Um, used to have some issues loading. We'll probably take a crack at that. And then for a long time, they were um, just a little bit shy of being petted. So today I'm gonna work on some of the petting stuff and work on getting them better, hopefully, about doing more behaviors for fewer reinforcers and just keep it fun. I want them to have a good time. So we'll just be doing some fun stuff still. Um, and then we'll probably move on to some halter work, uh, doing some more stuff with some of their other handlers so that we're all on the same page. Uh, but that's down the road. Um, I'm a positive reinforcement trainer, clicker trainer. Been doing that for over a decade now. Um, I have certifications in it and I've worked with a lot of different kinds of animals um, beyond just my horse and the dogs. I also have trained crows, pigs, goats, probably some other things that I'm not thinking of. Um, hornets. I like to train all the wasps that fly into my house. They're pretty fun to train, that sort of thing. So um, quicker training, positive reinforcement training just works based on uh, the science of learning that is fundamental to all animals. So you can do it with anything. All right. I think what I'll do is move in and out of here um, and give them a couple of breaks. But I'm going to let the divas loose now. And if you do have some questions for me, just feel free to chime in on chat. Jake will let me know. Thanks, Jake, for cam opping. Hi, ladies. How are we? Okay, you open that up. Good job. Come with me. Hi. Good job. Everybody gets a treat. Including you too. Yep. Okay, let's go. Ha. Huh. Gertie really loves training, but she also likes making sure that Maud doesn't get as much training as her, because she's pretty sure she could, she needs more of an education than Maud does. Gertie likes to play following games. Whoa, back up. It's this one. Back up sometimes disappears for her. That's okay. You're still doing a really good job. There it is. There's your backup. Nailed it. Oh, good work, guys. Let's go. Donkey train. Yeehaw. <laughs> Whoa. Backup. 
Good job. <laughs> All right, so now we're going to do a little bit of touch desensitization work. I think I can do this with both of them at once, but we'll see. So at first, Gertie says, I want to do my rear. Yeah, don't be all mean to your sister. Rear. Oh, what a handsome rear that was. You can go, Mod. Okay, so I'm going to try and do target. So that's just a hand target. Again, hand target. <laughs> Cardi's a little distracted by Mod being there. That's my, that's my arm. <laughs> try it again. It's this thing. I'll take it. Okay, so they're more familiar with that when they're not close together because that's just a big distraction. So let's see what we get. Good. Good work, ladies. Yeah, you did really good too. Yeah. Let's see if we can get some from Mod. Mod's a little better with her hand target, aren't you? Yeah. Clearly just touching my hand. And Gertie's just getting treats for hanging out. Just hopefully help them get better about the pushiness next to each other by... What is it? Yeah, good job, you two. We do a little carrot for you and a little carrot for you. Let's go over here. It's important when you're training to kind of move it about a little bit. See if anybody gets my hand. Dan, not to get pushy with your sister. That's diminished a lot, though. That's good to see. She used to be much worse about it. There you go. I know it's coming. Let me see if we can get another one over here. is already. There it is. Target training is handy for a lot of things, including helping them move around. But what I'm going to start using it for is an initiator and consent cue for petting and see if we can't get better about wanting to be touched. Mostly for Gertz. <laughs> what is it? What is it? Good job. <coughs> Excuse me. Fighting a little cold here, too. Good. So, last time I pet. Oh, careful. That's good. That time I didn't. This time I will again. Oh, that's pretty good. I'm going to try and reduce the uh, amount of touch that I give there. Just like, I don't know. We'll play it with Mod this time. Good job, you two. Yeah, that was great. Here's that. And here you go. <coughs> Excuse me. This cold is really getting to me. Yeah. Says, I'll take some touching for treats. No problem. Yeah, you like it. There you go. There you go. Touch, it's a pet. Since she's comfortable, I'm gonna just take a little bit further with her. 
you can tell that Gertie is less comfortable because she moves away. A little more touch sensitive. Let's see if I can do one with her. That was pretty good. What do you think about going over here, guys? <laughs> so sassy, Gertie. It's like, I'm going to get it. <laughs> I got this. <laughs> She's really, you can tell that Gert's still a little bit not into the touch, but not to the level where I think we're going to sensitize her by doing it. And she can just not hit my hand, and then she won't get pet on that one. And we'll give Mon an opportunity. Good job. Yeah, way to wait your turn, too, and not be all mad about it. Let me see what she thinks about it this time. <laughs> Mon's like, I will definitely get pet. Well, leave your sister alone. There you go. You got that incidentally. Didn't you? I got you. Mod. Mod. Here's your treat. Yeah, you can have a little more, too. All right. We're going to do just a little bit more training and see if we can give them all a break. Oh, good. Very good. Careful, careful. I need to get grumpy with your sister. Very good job, Gertie. Like seeing that. That's better. Good job. Come on, wants one. Great. All right, I'm gonna give them a little break since that was a good go. We can clean up their mess. <coughs> Excuse me. Fighting this cold. Mod says she wants to train more. Touch. Good job. Rear. Kurtz, you missed it. <laughs> I forgot that Gertie had fist bump. Gertie, fist bump. Rear. <laughs> Are you tired? You wear your, your little brain. Touch. Good job, you two. And good work you're doing together. Gertz. All right, I'm going to give them a little break. Take a break. And go get some carrots. Eventually, we'll transfer this game into putting on their gear so that they have a really positive experience with it. But that's really good. And I just refreshers games that we used to play. So 
so it looks like we'll do about another five, 10 minutes. About enough time for just like one more round. And then um, I will get together with Jake and we'll do some dog training. Um, a couple announcements there. I'm just gonna cut up a few reinforcers here while you all spy on the divas for me. Tell me what they're getting up to when I have my back turned. Probably some sort of mischief, because they do love mischief. It's important to take breaks anytime you're learning something new. It's true with the divas, it's true with dogs, it's true with horses, and it's true with you. Um, if you're working on something new, five minute break after, you know, especially with humans, like we can get away with a little bit longer, but even just five, after five or 10 minutes of working on something new, you'll progress a lot faster if you make sure and build in those little tiny breaks for your brain to think about what you're doing. Oof. Good singing. Anybody have a report out for me? Didn't sound like you guys got up to too much trouble. I was expecting you to get into trouble. That's what you're supposed to do. I owe you one. There you go. And now I'm just conditioning Gertie to think it's a good thing when Mod gets a treat by clicking Gertie every time Mod gets a treat. We like to fight over him, so. All right, let's go, guys. Oh, there it is. You had to just do your push. Fist bump. Oh, good one. This one. <laughs> Just expecting. No, hey, hey, hey. Take it easy, kid. Especially when she's getting tired, good. You can get a little grumpy. Can you back up? There you go. Target. Good job. There you go. Here. Yeah, that's where you shine. Oh, good job. Fist pump. <laughs> there it is. Touch. Good job, everybody. You dropped it. Did you get it? Okay, cool. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Back up. This is why you go backwards. Don't. Oh, good job. You didn't get at your sister. Touch. Fist bump. Good job. There you go. Good job. Look at this. It's a little bit bigger of a treat, so I'll give him a second to work on it. She's actually taking that penny much better than she used to. Moving away just slightly. Wind's coming in. Seems like there might be a storm brewing. What do you ladies think? 
not interested in the fist bump, that's okay. Let's see if Mod wants to target. Still working on oh good target. Good. See if we can do it down low. Fist bump. That was great. <laughs> See if we can get two fist bumps Oop. without breaking the wire on the cord. Oh, we got two. What a good job. All right, well, I think that's a good training session for today. I still have the project of getting them to go back into their stall, which they're not gonna wanna do, so I wanna leave a little bit for that. Huh, you wanna do one more? And some pets? Nope. That's pretty good. We're less sensitive to the petting when it happens from our side. That's good to know. Kurtz. I'm not interested in doing the this bump. Oh, thanks. That's nice. A little grooming behavior there. Good. Good job. That was sweet. Cool. Mod said she's ready to go back into her stall. Oh, are you not? Do you want to go back that way? I just want to do more training, please. Target. Good one. Oh, she gave me a little kiss on that target. That was really sweet. That was really nice. Here you go. I think I've worn them out. Kurt seems tired. Here. There you go. Cool. Alrighty. Oh, and look at this. Nick of time. So I'm gonna just make it interesting. Come in here. them some of the grass they can't reach they probably want and my bet is that as soon as Gert sees Mod getting a few things she's also going to want some good job Mod but who knows maybe she'll want to hold out find all the little pieces that she dropped in the gravel. <coughs> Excuse me. There she comes. Gertz! Bad recall tactic there using her name when I'm not sure she'll come but sometimes she likes it good job come here come get your reinforcer yeah you gotta <laughs> here you go you just gotta come in here here you go no one's after you What good ladies. What good divas you are, Sharon. Good luck. All right, I'll see you all in a little bit. Two weeks, and I'll see all of you 
here in about 15 minutes um, for a dog training session, which I get to work with Jake. So see y'all soon.